Well, temperatures across the area were just about normal for this time of year. 93 degrees was the high in Hattiesburg, but it was a little bit cooler in Collins and in Laurel, where our high was only in the upper 80s. 95 was the high in Richton, so it was definitely a hot one there. And of course, with the humidity, it felt about 5 to 10 degrees warmer. Those showers and thunderstorms that came in in the late to afternoon hours did help to cool things down a little bit. But overall, we did see very warm conditions today and more warm conditions to Tomorrow, increasing cloud cover with some afternoon thunderstorms possible. It's going to remain steamy through the end of the weekend, but as we move toward your Sunday, temperatures will be slightly below normal. We have more rain chances next week and the warm air will be back as well. So scattered showers and thunderstorms across our area today due to a stalled out cold front that moved through the region. And that cold front will just hang out in our area, just waffling around uh, the state a little bit, and that will keep things very unsettled. So once again, we do have the possibility of showers and thunderstorms tomorrow, but the best chances of rain will be in the afternoon after the heating of the day. But steamy conditions for sure, as a trough of low pressure is situated just to our south right now, and it's ensuring we're getting a lot of south winds, which of course is bringing that moisture from the Gulf of Mexico and a lot of heat as well. Our future radar is showing most of the activity uh, out there will start to die down after midnight. Notice it starts to really taper off around two or three and then tomorrow morning, maybe just a few stray showers. But I think the bulk of the activity will be coming in the afternoon. Notice it starts to really blossom in the afternoon with a few thunderstorms possible as well, but then dying down in the overnight uh, once again. And and starting up again on your Sunday, but I think the rain will come a little bit earlier on Sunday. And so as a result, those temperatures will be a little bit cooler, but definitely a steamy one out there with dew points around 71 degrees. That really won't change through the weekend and into next week. But temperature wise, we're going to be slightly below normal. Our average highs are in the low 90s. We're going to be slightly below that Sunday into Monday with temperatures even around 89 degrees in the afternoon on Monday, but then warming up on Tuesday as some of that sunshine will return. Here's a look at your forecast. Any thunderstorms out there will be dying down tonight, especially after midnight. We drop down to around 70 degrees in Laurel, 71 in Hattiesburg, 70 in Colorado. Collins, Bay Springs around 70 as well. So those temperatures will uh, be very mild as we start off the day, maybe feeling a little bit muggy in the morning, but by the afternoon or high only around 88 degrees in Laurel, uh, 90 degrees in Columbia. And so here's a look at your forecast as we move into the weekend. Those temperatures will stay mainly in the 90s, dropping down to around 89 degrees on Monday with scattered showers and a few thunderstorms. But we're going to see a little bit more sunshine on Tuesday. And so we're going to be back in that warm Again, temperatures very close to normal readings in the low 90s in the afternoon and because it's going to be humid, those temperatures at night will only drop down into the low 70s, 74 degrees Thursday uh, night into early Friday. And then we have another system that will come in late next week that could bring a lot of cloud cover and also more rain chances. That's a look at your weather.